I grew up knowing looking after domestic animals as employment is a job meant for men and not ladies. Until I met this video which shocked me. Does it mean that time is changing or are we fulfilling a phrase that says what a man can do, a woman can do better? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Eunice Okwe. In case you're new here, kindly remember to subscribe. And to all my returning subscribers, thank you so much for your continued support. This is a video of a Ugandan lady who is employed in one of the Gulf countries to look after domestic animals. I cannot say that it's something new to ladies. No, it has been there for ages. But what I know is that if you find a lady look if you find a lady doing this job, it, it is either uh, the animals belongs to the father or the husband or it is for the family. But I have never come across a lady employed to do that thing. Even back in our country, when somebody wants someone to look after their domestic animals, uh, they prefer men. That's why we have herdsmen, but I've never heard of a herdswoman. Or does it mean that we have more ladies outside there employed to do the same job? It's only that they have never been to limelight. It is a question that I'm asking myself today. Look at what she does.
that video, it is an assurance that this lady loves what she, she's doing. From the way she interacts with these animals to how she feeds them, how she plays around with them, inakwanisha kwamba kabisa anapenda kazi inyanaifanya kazi. So, my question is, for those people who are applying to go and work in Gulf countries, ukisha fika Gulf na tunawambio kwamba kazi yako itakuwa kuchunga hawa mifugo, how will you take it? If you are um, a man and your sister ame travel in Gulf countries, anakwambia nimefika na kazi nimeambiwa ni kwamba nitakuwa na chunga mifugo, how will you advise her? Or what will you advise her? If it is your wife, umemtuma to search for greener pasture in Gulf countries, alafu afiki ya kwambia kazi ni nimepata ya kuchunga wanyama, how will you take it? Or what will you advise her? Uh, kazi ya kuchonga wanyama ni kazi ngumu kiasi according to me vile wenye mimi huona kwa sababu ni kazi ambayo inahitaji nguvu sana inafaa uzikatie nyasi like the way you've seen in that video anaenda kuzikatia nyasi kusukuma hiyo nyasi na wilbaro uh, yani kuhakikisha kwamba hawa wanyama wako vizuri ni kazi ngumu ambayo huwa inataka wanaume wenye wako na misuli because wanaume kubeba hizo vitu vizito haina ugumu sana unlike ladies because ladies wanaonekana ni kama watu ambao wako weak so that is why ladies wana kwa preferred kufanya zile kazi nyepesi lakini si kazi nzito kama hii but huyu msichana ni kama anapenda kazi yake sana it's like amefanya hiyo kazi for the longest time anaipenda zaidi Sisemi ya kwamba wanawake hawezi kufanya hizi kazi. Huo wanafanya hata kule nyumbani huo wanafanya. Lakini huo wanafanya under someone so that if anything can happen they can be easily attended to. Cuz wanawake kubebana na hizo vitu nzito, alafu hapo kuna kuna mgongo, kuna kifua. Inakuwa ni shida sana kwa nini kwa afya yao. Na wakati yako pale nyumbani maybe the husband will help or any of the family member will help if it's a big family kuna shemeji labda atasaidia uh, kama ni pale nyumbani kwa wazazi saa zingine baba atasaidia ama atasaidia na dada yake mwingine ama the, the brother when the brother is not around utapata nafanya hii kazi ama kama anafanya kazi ni kutoka tu kwenda kutembeza hizi uh, au mifugo kwa field maybe one or two days alafu siku zingine au the, the men are taking over lakini hiyo kazi ya kukata atakata zile nyasi ndio but kari hizo kubeba hizo nyasi ni wanaume ndio wanafanya hiyo kazi so how am i taking this thing na sijui unaichukulia namna gani hiyo video ukiangalia if una travel na una ufike tuambia kwamba so this is the job that you're going to do will you take that job given that mifugo wanahitaji chakula yani wanahitaji chakula nyingi sana in a day ama kuna mtu ambaye huwa anasaidiana na naye so that they can take care of these animals but according to her videos sijaona kwamba kama kuna mtu mwingine anasaidiana naona ni kama tu wanaifanyia peke yake it means that we must change anafanya kazi smart sana hongera sana big up big up where you are because i know you are not a kenyan but i know one day you'll come across this video i'm just hoping that one day i will meet this girl and uh, we have a conversation with her then in later by up our channel i interview her so that she can tell us her life experience and how she takes her job how she finds it comfortable working doing that job in a foreign country so thank you so much for watching for all the ladies who are planning to go and work at, work in gulf do ya kwamba gulf inaweza pata kazi ya aina yoyote just be ready for anything and for all the ladies who are working in gulf Big up sana nyinyi watu wa nguvu na mwendele na that spirit. I'm not forgetting the men because you are really doing a great job. Uh, and then ni kufanya bibi, and then ni kusukumana and I know that God will help you. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, meet you again in the next video. Bye bye.